El Chapo is considered one of the biggest drug lords in the history of the world. He was the former head of the Sinaloa cartel, one of the largest drug trafficking cartels in the whole world. This international crime group flourished under the infamous rule of Joaquin Guzman, popularly known as El Chapo. But like we say, men are nothing without women. Just like that, El Chapo couldn't have achieved all of this without the support of his wife, Emma Coronel Aispuro. To know how she supported him, watch this video till the end. Here we go! Her real name is Emma Modesta Coronel Aspuro, but she is better known as El Chapo's wife. Like her husband, she holds a very prestigious position in society. She was a former beauty queen, and at an early age, she won the Coffee and Guava Festival beauty pageant that changed her life forever as it was huge. She had a lavish laissez-faire attitude toward the paparazzi, and she and El Chapo have nine-year-old twin daughters. But how did these two come together? Emma Coronel Aspiro was born in 1989 in Santa Clara, California, and grew up in the drug trade, earning her dual citizenship in the U.S. and Mexico. Her father belonged to the Sinaloa cartel, whose leader was El Chapo himself. Her uncle, Ignacio Coronel Villarreal, was also a member of this cartel and was regarded as one of Mexico's most dangerous men. She met her future husband, El Chapo, shortly after winning the beauty pageant. It's unclear whether it was love at first sight or the sight of the gunman in that building that finally convinced her to succumb to his charms. That remains a mystery, but her happily ever after ended when she was arrested in February 2007. Only two years after being convicted and sentenced to life in prison in a New York City trial, Chapo was sentenced to three years on charges of assisting her husband in running the billion-dollar empire and assisting him to flee from custody. When he was apprehended in 2014, she was also involved in financial transactions with the Sinaloa drug cartel. For months, Emma Coronel Aspiro has been on the radar of U.S. law enforcement. However, in June, she pleaded guilty to assisting El Chapo smuggling drugs across U.S. borders and assisting in a dramatic escape from Mexico's maximum security prison. When sentenced to prison by the Washington Federal District Court, she expressed her guilt and truly regretted her crimes. The evidence was a few BlackBerry messages presented to the judges, which proved that this woman assisted El Chapo in running his illicit drug business. Emma Coronel Aspiro also assisted her father, Ines Coronel Barreras, who was one of El Chapo's top lieutenants. He was apprehended in Mexico later that year. Other messages on her phone indicated that Emma was heavily involved in the famous tunnel escape of El Chapo from the Altiplano prison in Toluca, Mexico in 2015, but that's not all. In 2012, she even assisted El Chapo in evading capture by American authorities in Mexico during a botched raid in the Mexican resort town of Cabo San Lucas. During El Chapo's trial, his former chief of staff, Damaso Lopez, informed authorities that Emma had attempted to help her husband escape prison. When he was apprehended again in 2016 and returned to Altiplano, Damaso Lopez claimed that Emma plotted to bribe the officials of Mexico's top prison official, but luckily before the plot was put into action, El Chapo was extradited to the U.S. to stand trial. Emma Aispiro agreed to turn over $1.5 billion in illicit proceeds from her husband's illegal operation in the pleto she conducted with the government. She also admitted to assisting El Chapo in moving at least 450 kilograms of cocaine, 90 kilograms of heroin, and nearly 90,000 kilograms of marijuana from Colombia into the U.S. over the years, which is still less than other large criminal enterprises. According to her plea agreement, she received a relatively light sentence in part because, according to Anthony J. Nardozzi, a federal prosecutor, the defendant was not an organizer, leader, boss, or another type of manager, but rather a cog in a very large wheel of a criminal organization. Emma Coronel Aspiro also decided to cooperate with U.S. authorities against other members of El Chapo's organization. Still, according to court documents, Emma only assisted the government in prosecuting her case. Jeffrey Lickman, Emma's lawyer, dismissed the allegations that she had collaborated with the garbage government. She emphasized that Emma Coronel Esporto was still a minor when she was introduced to the world of drug trafficking, so she deserves mercy. He claims she met Joaquin Guzman when he was a minor when she was 17 and they married on her 18th birthday. He also stated that all of the allegations against her client had jeopardized her life. Given Emma Cornell Esporto's background, her sentences were weighted accordingly and she will be the sole caregiver for her children in the absence of El Chapo, serving a life sentence. Let us know your view in the comments below.